Welcome back to GTA Online. It is officially December, which means there is a brand new GTA Online update. It includes a whole bunch of new stuff, a bunch of brand new missions, and more importantly, some super, super cool cars. Earlier today, some people actually went into the game files for GTA and leaked these. These are some of the cars that are going to come out over the next couple of weeks. There is some super cool stuff in here. Starting with like an Alpine A10, a Lotus Avaya. There's an old Cadillac Eldorado, sort of, kind of. The car next to that kind of looks like a Subaru Brat, but I'm not convinced. An awesome little JCW Mini Cooper. An actual NASCAR truck. A car from the 1940s, and I have no idea what that thing is in the bottom right. Not gonna lie. Those cars are gonna be coming out like one every single week, probably for the next couple of weeks. Right now in GTA Online, if you go to the legendary motorsports, there are two brand new cars for you to check out. This is a Koenigsegg Jesco Absolute, or if you are boring at parties, a Koenigsegg Jesco. And this is a Nissan 400Z. And if you are also boring at parties, the Nissan Z. So today and tomorrow, we're gonna check these things out. It should be pretty cool. Although there's a bunch of really cool stuff coming in this update, there is um, a bit of a problem. 3.5 mil might sound like a lot, but we are gonna burn through all of that working on one car. So today is the day of making poor financial decisions. By the way, if you wanna contribute to my poor financial decisions even more, I am currently giving away an Xbox Series X to one of you guys. It is super simple to enter. One, all you need to do is subscribe here on YouTube. And number two, join the AR12 Discord server. And at the end of December, I'm going to pick a random user and give them an Xbox Series X. When you're given the chance to jump into a Koenigsegg Jesco Absolute, you jump in to the Koenigsegg Jesco Absolute. Ah, this is so expensive. One of the other new updates in GTA Online is apparently your cars are gonna get delivered to your like houses way faster than they did before. So we'll see if that's actually true. Oh my God, it's already here. That was like instant. Let's do a deep dive into the car. Take a look at the entire thing. Open up all of the doors. Wow, that is straight Koenigsegg with this super nice quilted like, I guess, leather in there that's awesome and then the engine is just wow nicely done gta that is so sick will it be the fastest car in grand theft auto online i have no idea let's jump into some gta online customization enjoy watching my bank account go to zero this is going to be fun brakes 31,000 bucks for some upgraded brakes bumpers okay so front bumpers for the Koenigsegg Jesco. Are these gonna be front splitters? They are gonna be front splitters. Okay, I kind of like that one though. That, that really fits the front bumper. Okay, rear bumpers. We've only got one option. So you're actually just making it black to carbon fiber. That is all. I don't think that's strictly worth it. Canards, no way. We've actually got some canards. So wait, oh, so you've got carbon fiber and regular black. I guess since my front splitter is carbon fiber, I will make my front canards carbon fiber as well. Engine customization, upgrade that all the way to the max. Exhaust, okay. We've got a whole bunch of options. Let's rev up the car. So stock, they're like this stainless steel type of material. We can make them black really nice titanium tip. Yo, you can get like Pagani exhausts. Okay, that's not bad. I kind of like the square one too. That one's not bad. Oh, what do we like? We definitely can't turn this thing into a Pagani. Just no way. I feel like I put titanium on all of my cars, but it's just cool. I am doing that. Let's go. 14 different hoods for this thing. So we can get a carbon fiber hood. We are probably going to run that. So tosses on a little line, carbon fiber, very nice little intake there. Very nice little intake there. I really like the black one. Okay. These aren't bad at all. I like these. These are really cool. I really like this one though. I, I don't know if it fits the car though. I feel like this actually works. 11K for that. Let's do it. Horn. I don't need one of those. Lights. I don't need any of those. Our livery, we will come back to that in a second. What can we do with our side mirrors? So we can actually make them white or carbon fiber. Neither of those are worth it. Our license plate, we'll toss our black one on. That just looks really cool. 
Our respray will come back to that as well. Our roof, okay. Full on convertible roof, or we could black out the roof. Then we could even get a pinstripe and carbon fiber. Yo, I feel like there's a little bit more people say no roof. We are gonna go no roof. Twitch chat has decided. How about our side skirts? So stock side skirts, carbon fiber, street side skirts. Those ones are really, really nice. Those ones are also really, really nice. Kind of go with the fins on the back of the car. So let's go for those. How about the rear wing on this thing? So my question is, are those fins actually the rear wing? No, they're not. Okay, so we can remove the rear wing altogether. That's really clean. We can can also make them carbon fiber we can make them xl that's really cool shark rear wing no way a gt rear wing xl what <laughs> all right then we've got a ducktail another ducktail that is so nice honestly there's the regular koenigsegg rear wing that's so nice Oh my god, that's full on the Koenigsegg rear wing. GTA fully said, we're just gonna make the real car. That is amazing. But I think we've got to lean into the absolute version of this thing. So I think bigger is better. I think you've got to go for the XL wing. It's just, it's so ridiculous. Sure, we're doing that. Very good. Okay, suspension, slam it up. Oh, bit sad. Upgrade the transmission. Very good. Turbo this thing for nearly 50k. The wheels, we will come back to that. And finally, tint up the windows. Stage two of our upgrades. Let's take a look at the liveries for this thing. So apparently you can get SSC racing stripes on there. Koenigsegg stripes. I love how the game fully just leans into it and calls it Swedish stripes. Two-tone stripes. Oh, oh, that's so the play. Yellow pinstripe. No way. Red pin straight. Then you can turn this thing into an actual race car. I don't know why it's got like a German flag. I feel like we gotta do that. The, the two-tone is just awesome. The only Koenigsegg I have ever seen in my life was this bright blue. And like it was a carbon fiber weave. It was the most beautiful looking color I think I've ever seen. I think blue is gonna be the answer. That looks so good. It's still a Koenigsegg Jesko Absolute, but it's that little bit different that maybe makes it very spicy looking. So I've literally got less than a million bucks in the bank now. Are you two for real? Look at what these guys did. They fully embraced the Swedish life. Kimmy went for like this dark blue with the yellow. That looks so good. But he did go for the massive rear wing. So I wouldn't call it an absolute anymore. But super, super nice looking car. I love the carbon fiber wheels that is a very nice touch and then ank went for this ridiculous looking one with the swedish livery i love the yellow tire letters to match and bullet holes to let you know you're in america before we jump into any proper races we've got a time trial all the way up at the top of the map that gives us the perfect opportunity to see the top speed of it top speed of this thing in real life the koenigsegg jesko absolute can do 310 miles an hour it is one of if not the world's fastest car is it though gta online's fastest car the nice thing about koenigseggs is you can still drive them even though the hood is open that's just for extra cooling we are going all the way to the other side of the map i think we just hit up the highway i think we run the highway go Come on, time trial. Come on, time trial. So it is raining, so I'm probably going to have a little less grip than I usually would, but I think we'll be okay. This is probably the best car for the time trial, considering its crazy top speed and that the time trial is just highway running. This will actually tell us how fast this car actually is, though. If it struggles in any way to make the time, then it's just not that fast. Wait, so Twitch chat is actually telling me that this car has more upgrades at HSW that are only available on next gen. Are you kidding me? I don't know where I need to cut, but I assume the game will tell me when I'm close. Okay, the game says to get off the highway up here. I'm gonna jump onto this side of the highway. I'm gonna take the left here so I don't have to go off road for too long. Here, AI, why? So we're gonna take the proper highway exit. It's on the left-hand side coming up very, very soon right here, left. Don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Thank you, game, thank you, game. Oh, I think I've got this. This Koenigsegg is cracked fast. We're still good over the sketchy bridge. We're good. I gotta send it. Where's the cut? No! No! 
We got Koenigsegg Jesko's forever. Go! Okay, go, 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 go. Oh, it's a slippery boy into corner one. Come on, Koenigsegg. We dropped down to P5, but I need some good corner exits. And I need some full sends. There we go. P4. Gaining. Gaining. No way are we letting a Lambo beat us. No way. That's mad. Okay, I should have some nice corner exits, though. He says as he drifts out and has a terrible corner exit. I remember this track. I almost died. That guy died. P4, baby. Oh, my God. The car slides into the corners. You can see what I mean. It's... It's so scary. The Lambo somehow ended up on the wrong side of the highway. What? Okay, we're right behind the Lambo. Gain, 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 gain. I'm not that confident with it going into the high speed corners because the car almost shakes when you go into those type of corners. Okay, beautiful. There you go. You can see what I mean right there with the shaking. We're gaining on the Lambo a little bit every time. The thing just slides out from under you. And there's nothing that you can do about it. Maybe on a circuit that has a little bit more straight line speed, it might be able to do even better. Somebody in chat says, is the car worth it? It depends what you want from it because the customization isn't great. The racing isn't great either. But I really like Koenigsegg. Really, really like Koenigsegg. And if you're also a big fan of Koenigsegg, then maybe it's worth it. But if you ignore that fact... Eh? I don't think I've ever done this in the middle of a customization video, but like I said, today is the day of poor financial decisions. I can't believe I spent 30 bucks on this game. And now I've got to transfer my character over. That's my character. Migrate my profile. You're about to permanently remove your GTA Online profile from a previous generation. That hurts. That hurts. It's so expensive. Oh my God. I literally went this far. I can't not do it now. Okay, then what else do I need? Look at the acceleration. This thing's gonna be mad. What about the brakes? The brakes, HSW brakes. It looks like all of the HSW parts are pretty much the same sort of things but they're forged carbon fiber. How special works livery. Those are cool. I'm not spending any more money on this. This should be so easy now. If this thing was worth it, it should do this no problem. And away we go. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got. Come on. It's got to be a full send run. It does feel pretty quick now, not gonna lie. This is so the run. Wow, look at the sun. The sun when it hits the car. That looks crazy. No skill issues. No skill issues. Brake. Truck. Don't jump too far. Beautiful. Okay, good, good, good. Sketchy bridge coming up. There's the sketchy bridge. No AI. No AI. We're good. We're good. Down. Slow and steady wins the race through here. I've got 30 seconds to spare. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. It's pretty. I think it's safe to say this car is pretty fast now. That is mental.